I work as an artist in China and currently reside in Xi'an. My name is Chao Xianwei. At the moment, I am an independent freelance artist, and I also have my very own art label known as the Painting House. So, because in Xi'an, compared to more traditional inland cities, I hope to create a team to liven up our cultural atmosphere. So this time, the works I took part in primarily focus on various hot social issues, such as the phenomena that have emerged after the domestic epidemic. I aim to create artworks from my personal perspective, utilizing popular images to convey my ideas. There are also some works that were created after the epidemic, a new series called Grand Theft Auto V, which is inspired by some ideas that I came up with while playing a game under Rockstar and created some works. My painting explores contradictions between society and ourselves, expressing images related to conflicts at the level of cognition, as well as depicting virtual and real structures in a thought-provoking manner. So, my initial understanding of Italy was actually when I learned about the Renaissance in elementary school. In this movement, we all know the three artists who emerged first, Leonardo da Vinci, Michelangelo, and Raphael. From their paintings, I learned the initial definition of beauty, including the use of the golden ratio in the process of painting, which I still use today. I believe this should be the greatest aesthetic value for all mankind, and it may have great significance in promoting the historical progress of humanity. Another possibility is that Italian food culture, including some visual aesthetic elements in their food culture, is influencing my painting. And then there is the automobile industry in Italy, which for me personally has the greatest impact on this generation. It encompasses Italy's consumer culture and the Italian interpretation of aesthetics. These things influence me personally everywhere, and I even feel that our generation has a great impact. So in fact, I believe that for me personally, I was born in the year 1993, and for artists from our generation, what they prioritize more is most likely their own selves. From a personal perspective, he expresses his personal thoughts on society, including his own ideas about the future and the world. Perhaps there are certain notable disparities in comparison to the pessimistic outlook of previous generations regarding Evergrande's story and fate. But for me, after the pandemic, I feel I've undergone a big change in my creative direction because I believe that in the post-pandemic era, it is imperative for each and every individual to reflect on how we can reevaluate our lives within the international community we are part of, where conflicts and even wars continue to occur between different societies and nations. Where is the precise location and direction that we are currently heading towards? Has the truth and reality that we previously defined now become invalid in the present day and age? I think this is a problem that may need to be considered more as a Chinese artist, including the fact that the domestic economy and economic recovery after the epidemic are not as good as expected. I hope to reflect on it from an artistic perspective. Moreover, my aspiration is to provide an enhanced aesthetic value that resonates with all of mankind. Hope is new for oneself through three years of pandemic, including the age of life I am in now, after turning 30 in 2021, called 2021 in ancient Chinese sayings. At this point, I aspire to produce artworks that are distinct from my previous ones by utilizing fresh insights and novel encounters. I am grateful to all of you for your support and encouragement.